Should Doug Marone be the head coach of the Jacksonville Football Jaguars in 2020? We thought it may happen this offseason. Go out and get ourselves a win because, you know, it's it's it stinks. But instead, the only pieces that were shipped out of Jacksonville were the players in return for future product. Marone even said it coming into the year. But I feel confident in, in this football team being able to handle uh, anything that's thrown at him. But even I said right here on First Coast Sports, he was playing left-handed with the roster this season. Who wants to buy season tickets to this again next year? Jesus, I mean, we, we, we're, trying, we're trying to win. With most of the football world looking at the Jaguars, wondering if they were set up for success, the question became, why not last year? You don't ever want it to end. You know, you want to try to keep you know, getting opportunities and try to keep winning, and, 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 and I think that's what's important. The 23 regular season wins for Marone and Jacksonville, it's tough to look at, but the 2017 AFC title game run will be something this city will always remember. Through it all the ups and downs, Marone, he always took things in stride. I'd, I'd like to keep competing every single week and keep playing, keep playing. For better or for worse, Marone's run in Jacksonville as the head man of the Jaguars has come to a close.